Hans headed directly south. Their first stop was an area occupied by Gershi, speaking Mo people. They were able to establish a federation with the Mo people. In the 8th century, the Masi people of Yatenga, the Gans and the Nizjibans, and the Mo people away from the area. The Gans and the other Gans followed the Tebas had left the Niger band earlier to establish their own state of Ganja. They wanted to establish their own states too. The first to do so was Ohenababia. Amia, her ard son Asman, and their followers crossed the Black Volta to establish their own Bono State Kingdom in. They soon built other settlement areas and made Bono. Mansu, their state capital, the direction of the Black Volta. They established the direction of the Black Volta and the Aquapem Mountain Range. Others headed in the coastal direction to reach the a few two areas around sea. The Bono State accommodated many of the ancestors of the future Aiken States. They include the Fantas who left Bono, Manso by way of Tekamen to march southward to Manxim areas, the Denkiras who left Kaira and settled initially at the Lake Bozumtwe in the Adansi area, the Jaima State, the Nzima State, Osu, Alata and Tandem with the Niger Bagger Band, Holton of Niger Bagger Band, Niger Band, and Matrilineal Social Structure. The decline of the once. Mighty Ghana Empire created a vacuum that the Aiken refugees opportunistically filled, consolidating their dominance over the indigenous groups and establishing a socio-economic foothold through activities like pottery, livestock rearing, and trade. Simultaneously, the Tebas, Having made a brief sojourn on the Niger Bend, decided to journey even further southward to Ganja, giving birth to the birth to Ganja stay in Benson and Inception of a series of Akan settlements, including the Akwamu State, Zima State, and Osu, Alada, each contributing to the intricate mosaic of Akan history. The Jai group, in collaboration with remnants of Gons and Tebas, chose a southwestern trajectory and found a new home in the Ivory Coast. Here the kingdoms of Bana and Kumbu, Akwamu. The collapse of the Ghana kingdom triggered the migration of Desplanink, the Mandu century, the Rizalto century. The Gold Coast, establishing states such as Akwamu, Doma, and Zima. The refugees from the Akwamu state, resilient and determined, went on to carve out their territories with Akwamu, Doma, and Zema emerging as distinct entities. Similarly, those from the Bona state and the Ivory Coast settled in the Adansi district, Akrocare, and integrated into the Bono Kingdom of State and by the Asante and by the Asante and by Kadi Shanti. Historical Trajectory of the Ekin Speaking People In the midst of these migrations and state formations, myths and legends like Iza, 
And he arose, immortalizing the indomitable spirit and unity of the Aiken speaking people. Doctor, Joseph Boki Donkwa's intriguing proposition regarding the Middle Eastern origin and the greater, more interconnected Aiken heritage. This journey in continents and centuries is an integral part in the East, influencing the diverse and dynamic cultural landscape they celebrate today. The Akin speakers, having established themselves in the Niger Bend, began to flourish as they absorbed and dominated the indigenous groups in the region. Engaging in activities such as pottery, livestock, and trade, the Aiken ancestors developed a unique matrilineal system that shaped the culifying their communities. As the Ghana Empire waned in power, the Aiken refugees lived in Bend undertook another migration further south to Gbon. Da da. The Gons, the Gons, Jia group, and Garamantes, on the other hand, charted different courses. The Gons, inspired by the success story of the Ganja state, established their own Bono state kingdom in. This marked the beginning of a wave of Akan settlement in the Gold Coast, with various groups founding states such as the Akwamu state and Osirini eventually settling in the Ivory Coast Terry, eventually in Chile, Surrey, Surrey, kingdoms of Bona and Kumbu, Akwamu. The collapse of the Ghana Kingdom Inn prompted a group of displaced Sanink, known as the Mandes, to move south. Fierce fighters, the Mandes conquered the Buona, and Akwamu states during the century leading war refugees to establish new settlement areas in the Gold Coast. Thank you for watching up to this point. Watch out for the next video in our series. Once again, you are welcome to the ultimate voyage through the fabric of human existence and culture existence. Secrets of the Past, Present, and Even the Mysterious Passageways of Prehistoric Times. As we go across the cosmos and explore the core of human history, culture, and existence, I'm ecstatic to be your guide. Thank you.